Yeah, we are live. Peace and blessings, everybody. Your neighborhood homie, MC Medina, and we are live right now. This is Conscious Crypto every single weekday at 2 p.m. Central Standard Time. And um, this is Casa de Prana TV. We're in the underground bunker, an undis undisclosed location somewhere in Houston, Texas. And um, today we have the market is up all across the board bitcoin ethereum xrp dogecoin everything is up looks like bitcoin we got 44,000 ethereum is at 3,000 and 33 dollars xrp 95 cents that's a um almost a four point increase percentage increase we're going to be getting into different news in regards to uh, to Bitcoin, Ethereum, cryptocurrency, and uh, the general idea of the DeFi movement today on Conscious Crypto here on Casa de Prana TV. Thank y'all for hanging out. Please leave comments below. Uh, I need to see if I can get my uh, yerba mate here in a little bit, but before we get started and get get too far ahead i want to mention uh have a brief segment about the casa de prana roasted cacao beans now these cacao beans are coming straight from el salvador and if uh, you don't already know about cacao beans these are a super food this is food of the gods so cacao's got rare trace elements like uh, manganese magnesium uh, zinc and so this is food for longevity. Get yours today. Leave your comments below and uh, we'll make sure, get your address and we'll send you some out. Okay, and uh, what do we have today? Bitcoin whales move record amounts of Bitcoin around. Uh, let's see, what do we have in the latest news today? Uh, looks like huge moves all across the board here it says uh bitcoin holds crucial support at 40,000 uh that we're going to get into the market watch guy electra will be coming in shortly as well um we've got the second largest ethereum mining pool to suspend all operations part of the latest news right there by helen parts we're going to be getting into that as well later on in the segment if you have if we have anybody in the uh, chat right now i want to answer any questions that you might have about um ethereum cryptocurrency in general um in the meantime i gotta see if i can remember where i left my yerba mate i think it might be by the computer over here any anybody in the chat want to ask some questions appreciate y'all checking in thank you guy electric checking in and uh, we also want to send a heart anybody in the chat right now if you're in the chat please put a heart up for david prana el, el, el pana psicodélico behind the scenes making everything happen around here with the lights and the cameras and the and the computers and the action and so put a heart in the in the comments right there for mr david rodriguez blessing us with his presence during this session today too conscious crypto my name is mc medina every single weekday at two o'clock central standard time we're giving you crypto news with a conscious more self-aware spin to it we want to focus mainly on the DeFi movement i see marley over there hopping around we're going to bring marley in and um put a thumbs up in the comments 
If you want to see Marley, we're going to bring Marley in. We're going back to the Bitcoin whales moving record Bitcoin value as metric sounds alarm over the price volatility. Check it out. Bitcoin price action may be boring for many, but whales have been busier than ever behind the scenes is what all the data ex is suggesting. Now, what exactly is a whale? Give me a second. Let me take a sip and I'm going to tell you. We're also going to get some music going. I forgot to press play on that earlier. All right. So now that we got the music going, we're going to get the vibes, get the vibes popping. We're going to get into what is a whale now in the cryptocurrency um, arena in the, in the cryptocurrency industry, whales are referred to as people who are making big moves, big money moves. So normally we have people like corporations, uh, governments, loaning institutions like Fidelity, uh, JP Morgan, Morgan Stanley, uh, different real estate companies. Whenever we have people like Elon Musk or Michael Saylor, um, and, and, and people like that, Ben Armstrong, when we have people like this that are, that are making purchasing moves or converting, uh, certain cryptocurrencies from, from Bitcoin to another altcoin or from an altcoin to Bitcoin. So big whale moves are referred to whenever we see large banking institutions or people with huge like hedge funds and huge um, budgets making moves. So what we're seeing here is we got a lot of whales making moves behind the scenes as far as um, the analysts are seeing a lot of short-term volatility as the whales begin some unprecedented behavior. According to the news, fresh data shows that the whales have not only been highly active on the market, they've been moving record amounts of Bitcoin. So there's still more Bitcoin being uh, mined every single day. We're going to get into the mining news here in a little bit. And uh, what exactly Bitcoin mining? What does that even mean? Well, activity beats Bitcoin all time highs, according to the latest news, despite Bitcoin price action staying in a narrow uninspiring range of around 40,000 large volume Bitcoin investors are anything but calm in the recent weeks. These whales have shifted more coins around the network than ever before, even more than during the all time Bitcoin and USD highs of $60,000 and above that we saw uh, about a year ago transactions involving 10 million and over recently hit more than 10 billion um we see here lex lex moskovsky uh claiming that wells have been moving record amount of bitcoin in the last two weeks total transfer volume of 10 million plus transactions keep staying at ath lately it's even higher than when the price was at 55 to 60k so further analysis of the action shows that different classes of wells have exhibited different reactions to recent price events smaller wells have been selling while the largest volume investors have conversely added to their po positions data from on-chain analytics resource material indicators revealed this week so smaller wells have been selling while the largest while the largest volume investors have conversely added to their positions so we're seeing a lot of growth across the board so if you're trying to understand these whale games look to the thin liquidity they are trying to play to the upside so i want to make sure that everybody uh, has an opportunity to ask any questions. If you're in the chat, please ask questions now. Uh, we are going to get into some of the chats going on here online and see what questions people might have. Big, big whale movement. As we're seeing here, uh, Bitcoin is continuing to go up even during the show here. 
And while we're providing you this content. <laughs> and uh, by the way, the music is being brought to you right now. Uh, it's all 100%. It's all 100% original music uh, put together by myself. Um, also, we have some music put together with me and uh, Mr. David Rodriguez, some music that we're going to be featuring later on in the show as well, uh, featuring Guy Electra. So all the music you can find online, make sure you, you, whatever streaming platform you use, whether it's YouTube, Spotify, Pandora, Apple Music, Google Play, Deezer, Tidal, whatever platform you use, make sure you look up MC Medina and uh, Conscious Crypto. Every single weekday at 2 p.m. in the afternoon is being brought to you by Divine Garments. So please make sure that you click the link that says Planet MC Medina and uh, go check out the Divine Garment store. Soon we're gonna be adding some crypto swag, so you'll be able to be really bossed up with your crypto swag coming soon too, guys. We're gonna be getting into some more news here. Guy Electra um, will be joining us here with a little bit of some numbers. Now let's get into the next big news segment right now. Um, we wanted to get into the Ethereum bears. <laughs> this is uh, two hours ago. Ethereum bears are looking to score on Friday's 340 million weekly Ethereum options expiry. Derivative data shows bears have sufficient initiatives to keep Ethereum price below 3,000 heading into the 340 million options expiry on October 1st. October 1st, that is tomorrow. Ethereum price has seen quite a bit of volatility lately and to the surprise of many traders, the $40,000 level continues to present considerable resistance. Currently, the price is respecting the upward channel, which started in August, uh, but every time the support is tested, the risk of an aggressive correction increases. So with that in mind, the $340 million options expiry on October 1st will likely be dominated by neutral to bearish put options. What does this mean? Bulls place larger bets for the expiry, but when it appears that they are too optimistic for October 1st, so their 215 million call or buy options are getting closer with the looming approach of the expiry date. We're seeing a, uh, the largest NFT marketplace right now, OpenSea, represents over 20% of the entire Ethereum network's gas use in the past 24 hours. We're gonna be getting into NFTs here shortly, We're, uh, into that segment. When analyzing the incredible demand for blockchain transactions, Polygon's co-founder Sam Deep Nawal, who we mentioned earlier uh, a couple days ago, says that it's just a matter of time before Ethereum overtakes Bitcoin as a dominant layer one protocol. We mentioned that uh, a couple days ago. If you haven't already invested in Ethereum, I highly recommend that you at least learn more about the Ethereum blockchain. It has a whole ecosystem involved with it. The ecosystem is also in alignment and working together with the DeFi movement, the global decentralization of the financial system. And uh, Ethereum has a purpose and application for the future of humanity when it comes to uh, artificial intelligence, when it comes to augmented reality, uh, robots, and a uh, resource-based economy where um, we can be more self-sufficient and um, become more self-sustainable. So bulls placed more bets, but there's a, there's a catch. The 1.74 call to put ratio represents the slight difference between the 215 million worth of call or buy options versus the 125 million put or sell options. Although favoring bulls, this broader view needs a more detailed analysis because some of those bets are implausible considering that the current $2,800 price. Ethereum is actually up 
7.23% in the last 24 hours. So we're seeing Ethereum past 3000. If you're holding Ethereum, please leave a thumbs up in the comments. Uh, if you guys have any questions also we need to address, please let me know what questions you have. We're going to also check in here online, see what the community is saying. Hopefully we'll be bringing in some, oh, I have a special announcement. As a matter of fact, um, this coming up Tuesday, we have a special guest that I uh, need to announce. Uh, my big brother, John, uh, John is the guy who got me into crypto. His name is John Bush, Baba John, big Papa John. There's a lot of different names for this man. He's the one responsible for putting me onto Bitcoin several years ago, over a decade ago. Uh, we both have experienced considerable amount of gains. Uh, this guy is known as the wizard of reuse. He is a zero waste master. And uh, he's, he's, he's the owner of um, a company who is responsible for incubating new businesses and new owners, uh, new business owners to the new green economy and, and a global uh, resource-based economy. So all green business practice, uh, practices, he's a B corporation. Uh, he's going to bring more information about what is a B Corp, how to get involved and get started with the B Corp. He's going to tell us his story about crypto and how he also learned about Bitcoin. Um, so he, he's like a big brother to me. So make sure you all tune in next Tuesday for John Bush, Baba John, the wizard of reuse. He's going to be hanging out with us. So we'll be making a flyer for all that coming up soon. Um, so you guys keep your eyes peeled for that. We're going to be getting into some more market news here shortly. Uh, we've got Guy Electra that will be joining us soon as well. Please leave any any questions and comments below. Got to have you all uh, leave a thumbs up as well for uh, Mr. David Rodriguez behind the scenes, making it happen over here. I need to see if I'm gonna open up the Twitch account. <laughs> We're gonna check in. Uh, big, big news guys, seven hours ago, Visa is working on blockchain intra, uh, what is it? Interoperability hub for crypto payments, Visa. So we're gonna get into that news here coming up really, really soon. I need y'all to ask any questions that you may have. I see we got a few people here with us now. Um, oh yeah, let's see, we can send a wave. <laughs> oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, this is looking great. Any questions in the chat? We got Guy Electra setting up right now. We're gonna do a brief segment and spot spotlight on her. Oh man, and we also have another special guest with us today. So, uh, so super special. All right, yeah, yeah. Let's go over, go over to Miss Guy Electra and Marley. Hey. What is going on? How are you doing? I am doing good, and you? I'm just a little wet. <laughs> <laughs> Marley, Marley's gonna be bringing in some more news for us. Marley's got the crypto news today, guys. Hey, Marley, say hi. Hey, little buddy, how are you doing today? It's been raining around here, so he's uh. I'm gonna see if I can share. Marley. I'm gonna see if I can share this clip, um, but I want to wait until Marley shows up in the frame so I can share the clip with with Marley. <clears throat> I think that would be so, so dope. Marley already wants to go down. He's a little confused about all this crypto. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, put him on, put him on your other side because you, can, you can't really see him on that. Okay. 
Uh, yeah, on that side. Yeah, yeah. And then you can scoot over to your right a little bit. Oh, yeah. Yeah, as long as you're right there in the middle of that banner behind you, you're perfectly centered. It's okay, Marley. We're just hanging out. Oh, yeah. Conscious Crypto, y'all. We got, we got Marley hanging out with us. I'm waiting to see if I can get you back in the frame here because now it's... Oh, man. Let's, oh, yep, yep, that, she's back in the frame, perfect, okay, let's see, Marley, 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 okay, yeah, 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 <laughs> so now if you go to the Casa de Prana, hello guys, my name oh, is Marley, and he's so, he's so white that, oh yeah, this is perfect, 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 I'm perfect, white and wet, white and wet, from the rain, conscious crypto, guys, Every single weekday at two o'clock in the afternoon, Guy Electra is gonna. Oh, this is perfect right here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's perfect. I see that now. Oh wait, 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 wait. Okay, okay. Let's see. Share clip. Oh yeah, that. Say bye, Marley. Thank you. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's awesome. Now we can share all that. That's fabulous. Yeah, thank y'all for hanging out right now. This is Conscious Crypto every single weekday. I just want to make sure we get a top, an opportunity to uh, copy the link. Uh, we're going to be sharing this on all of our social medias. If you're watching right now, please, please leave a comment. I want to know where are you watching from while we do this thing that we call sharing. Then we're going to get into the Visa. Uh, yes, the credit card company. If you own a Visa, put a thumbs up. Put a thumbs up in the comments below. Um, while we do this sharing. And then uh, this music right now is being brought to you by Conscious Minds Entertainment. And uh, again, my name is MC Medina every single weekday at 2 o'clock. Uh, a lot of times with Miss Guy Electra. Oh, we're celebrating a brand new single release for tomorrow. So I want to I wanna uh, recommend everybody check out the, the new Shiva Ya remix. We'll, we'll probably be playing it here in a little bit too. Comments below, please. Any questions about crypto, I'm going to address whatever you want to know. And if I don't know, I'm going to find out, guys, for real. I've got a team of advisors that are helping me with programming for the show. And um, again, big brother John Bush is going to be here on Tuesday. Special, special interview, guys. So between now and then... Uh, what we're going to have to do, uh, Brother Dave, is um, between now and Tuesday, I got to figure out how to do a Zoom meeting and bring it onto the screen. That's going to be a, that's going to be an interesting situation. <laughs> All right. Uh, let's see. We are live. with conscious crypto bam all right guys we're going to be bringing in miss guy electra she's back with us and uh, we're sharing and caring right now. Bam. Miss Guy Electra, what have you been up to? How are you doing today? How are you feeling? You look great. Thank you. Mm -hmm. I feel great. Mm -hmm. Yeah. The glasses match the hair. Thank you. Let's go. Yes. I got a good night's sleep. And the um, the chakra... The throat chakra symbol right is right above you is also blue. It's it's it matches great. I love that. I'm meant to be here. Yeah, it's great to have you. How's everyone doing in the chat? Oh. 
Ready for some conscious crypto? I'm ready for some music. Here we go. All right, guys, I got the prices here for you guys. Some of these prices checking out here on the computer. Because, you know, Bitcoin altcoins change the price within a second. Okay. From Bitcoin from 41,000 went all the way up to 43,000. So right now that's what we're looking at. Um, 40, actually almost 44,000. So it went up about 6.9%. Um, market cap is looking, it's, it's looking good. Um, let's go to Ethereum. Let's do it. Ethereum is 3,000. It went up a 7.17 for those who are buying and selling. Um, this was a really good profit. Um, if you bought, that's that's an epic gain right there. Yeah, if you bought when it was at 41,000. Look, six percent. No one's getting those types of gains on in the stock market or even holding money in your bank right now. That's what I'm wanting to tell people. These gains are are really beneficial i mean there yeah i mean it could be within two days so it's it changes very very quickly um cardano we have two dollars and 12 cents um it looks like it went up three point oh interesting three point seven uh seventy percent um i'm just looking at this new category it says nft which I've never seen it before. It gives you the numbers and the percentages for the NFTs. Oh, really? Yeah. How, how is that looking right now? What's the NFT market looking like? Bitcoin, um, there is a seven day percentage. I guess it's not through the 24 hour, like the um, percentages of increases is, but this is a seven day and so it says bitcoin it's down 1.91 percent for nft wow. and ethereum is, ethereum is down 3.99 percent so um ethereum is down you said yeah 3.99 like almost four percent um are you talking about for the nfts right yeah it says nft but it's a percentage within a week uh, it's very interesting. I've just never seen that. Okay, got you, got you. Um, Cardano, we said it was two dollars and twelve cents. It's increased. It's down on the NFT about six percent. XRP is up. Yeah, I saw that three point two five. Is that what you're seeing? Uh, surprise. Oh, the, the, yeah, 3.30% is what I'm seeing. Yeah, 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 okay. Solana, we got Solana going up 6.14%. It's 141.94 at the moment. Okay. Then we got Polka Dot. Polka Dot? Right. Polka Dot. Yeah, I was gonna I was gonna um, talk about polka dot because not a lot of people know too much about what they're doing. Yeah, what's the deal with polka dot? Polka dot. Polka dot. I'm gonna um, open up that information here, and uh, polka let's dot. see, because I know that's I've put money into polka dot before. That's twenty eight point five eight, twenty eight fifty eight. It's a great time to buy it. It's up six point six point twenty percent. I thought I had it in my. Uh, um, then we have Dogecoin with point two zero three eight percent. Um, sorry, Here price. It, Here. it looks like it's up. Dogecoin's coming up. Doge going up. Yeah, I see that. Uh, let's see. Polka dot. Polk. 
polka dot. There we go. Yeah, polka dot, also known as DOT, is the next generation blockchain protocol connecting multiple specialized blockchains into one unified network. So what so what we see here is there's several different blockchains. Um, each uh, there's a lot of altcoins that have its own ecosystem and or a blockchain and so what polka dot is going to do is kind of like do you remember back in the day did you have icq it was like a messenger app it sounds familiar so back in the day we had aol messenger remember that uh-huh. we had icq um and then we also had yahoo messenger and there was an app that would bring all three of those messengers into one messenger it was called trillion so polka dot is kind of like that where like it's taking multiple different networks and bringing them into one large network which is going to be really necessary in the future because the development of this uh these different cryptos and the development of the d different um ecosystems and blockchains is really huge right now so that's a little bit about polka dot y'all make sure learn more about polka dot i highly recommend that what else do we got, Miss Gaia Electra? Uh, we have, okay, we talked about Dogecoin go coming up 3.2. Yeah, those. 3%, 23%. I'm seeing 3.59%. That's what I'm seeing at the moment. But again, I'll have to refresh this. I'm on coinmarketcap.com. Okay, sweet. Yep, that's where we want to refer everybody to go to there. If you want to have the latest. I can just refresh it. Just and the know. latest stats. And then here after Terra Luna. We also um wanna Terra encourage Luna. everybody to stick around because after this we're gonna give you the latest news on Visa, the credit card company, and how they're gonna be uh incorporating crypto yes. payments into their Yes, yeah, it's coming up I gotta guys. Survive. <laughs> <laughs> I do have some amazing news about TikTok too Let's go. as well. TikTok too. Let's TikTok go. TikTok and TikTok at all. And then we're gonna after this after this hour we're gonna walk it out too. Walk it out, walk it out. Mm -hmm. Thanks for the music. Yeah, this market watch segment is being brought to you by Divine Garments. Once again, please, 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 if if you don't go to lovemedina.com, then just click on Planet MC Medina. And check out Divine Garments. Help us help you. All the money goes towards buying better equipment and. We're gonna get some lights and a whole bunch of fun stuff added here to the studio. Ooh. Mm -hmm. Y'all get some new outfits. New outfits, new rabbits, all that. They said they like rabbits, I don't know. That we like them is one thing. That we want a lot of rabbits, <laughs> it's another one. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good point. That's awesome. Okay, so I got this TikTok news, and I can't wait to talk about it anymore. TikTok has announced plans to release NFT collectibles based on popular videos on the social sharing service. Wow. So just like the NFL is doing capturing these moments, like creators are going to be able to capture their best streaming moments as well. Wow. And then they can own it. Yes, and there's some, a couple of celebrities already um, in this. Wait, you got to tell me who are these celebrities? It's going to be tough for me to um, pronounce his names. Oh, okay. <laughs> and I don't recognize any of them. Oh, man. I don't. That's what it, it's NFT. Yeah. Oh, no. With celebrity partners. Yeah. Lil Nas X. Little Nas X. Okay, that's him. Okay, what else we got? Um, Gary Vaynerchuk. Vaynerchuk. Okay, okay, okay. I don't know. If, I don't know if I've heard of uh, that. And then that's that's it. That's those two right now. Um. Ooh. Looks like rapper Lil Uzi Vert deletes a promo. Um, and the Eternal Beings NFT prices plunge after he deleted the promo. That's crazy. Uh, yeah, I mean, a lot of this, 
a lot of the NFT market is um, is based on hype. So, of course, a, a lot of times people find themselves. Sounds like all the markets. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it's an interesting situation. All right, let's see. We also have firm announce a partnership with crypto music service Audius. Oh, really? Yeah, I had no idea that Audius was a thing. Now I know. This is why I love doing this talk, because I learned so much. Yeah, comment below, please, please, please. Okay, we have blockchain yes, streaming platform. Who's out there? Blockchain streaming platform Audius announces Solana. Mm -hmm. Solana NFT integration. The Audius? Yeah, Audius announces Solana. Solana. Okay, okay. Oh, this is a pretty cool image that they have online, man. So the, the partnership allows Audius users to share songs directly on TikTok mm -hmm. for the purpose of creating short videos. I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to look into this. Yes. I mean, let's see. Okay, the market for non fungible tokens or NFTs has grown exponentially over the past year. Now, users of Audius will be able to feature NFTs from the Solana ecosystem in addition to Ethereum. Oh man, this is oh, huge nice. news. Okay. This is huge news. Blockchain based music streaming platform Audius, which we're gonna have to create an account with apparently. Uh, announced Thursday that it had launched full Solana NFT integration. This is today news from today, September 30th. Okay. Audius announced it's full. It's launched full Solana NFT integrations, allowing its m more than 6 million users to begin featuring digital collectibles from the Solana library. The integration will occur through phantom Solana's multi chain wallet and browser extension the new features will be available to audius silver tier profiles accounts holding more than a hundred of the platform's native audio tokens ronel rumberg audius's co-founder and ceo said that the partnership gives solana its first nft discovery layer adding that Tooling from Metaplex and the Audius integration with Phantom made it possible to ship Solana support without maintaining the usability bar that Audius has become known for. As Cointelegraph reported, Metaplex is an NFT marketplace that launched in June on the Solana network. Several celebrities and businesses have endorsed it uh, and did endorse it at that time. Uh, Audius, meanwhile, has been in the headlines after it announced a new partnership with TikTok. And we're getting into the TikTok news, the popular social media platform. The partnership allows Audius users to share songs directly on TikTok for the purpose of creating short videos. Since launching in 2017, TikTok has become one of the world's largest social media platforms, boasting nearly 1 million active monthly users. NFTs have permeated mainstream consciousness thanks to high-profile celebrity endorsements, multi-million dollar collections, and a growing recognition that digital collectibles are the future. NFT sales reached $900 million in August alone, easily shattering the previous monthly record set in May at $255 million. It's crazy. May sold $255 million worth of NFTs. August 900 million. So it, it can only go up from here. I love that. That is amazing. And Solana <coughs> is $140. So it's so much opportunity, guys. Look, guys, look into Solana. Learn more about Solana. I recommend that you, uh, I mean, I'm not a financial advisor. I'm not a financial you know, expert. Yes. Okay. So we're not financial experts. I recommend looking into Solana and buying some. Yes. And I also, what I've been downloading um, is from the Cosmic Ethereum realms. 
It's um, looking ethereal at ethereal realm. Ethereum okay. realms. That's what I said. Gotcha. Gotcha. Okay. Okay. That's a new one. Um, um, I'm looking at 2022. It's like, okay, so all these news are coming out and we got to prepare our m goals, right? Our new year resolutions are coming up. Our plan, our strategy for uh, this new Correct. digital world. So um, it's like making a strategy and a plan. Like, okay, well, with Ethereum, the platform, you're going to be able to, now we're able to get NFT. So there's going to be a plan and a budget, you know, to set that aside. Right. So you can start creating your NFTs and start talking about it. Like the creators, so you can start monetizing that. Right. Correct. Then, uh, we have the TikTok platforms for the creators and influencers of TikTok. Then start to get ready for that, um, that jump because that's, probably going to be the future and what's going to be able to support your business um your live streaming business correct and so so yeah having a plan for solana and ethereum for the nfts it's um you know on, on how you can start making your budget your plan to uh for the future for the future of creativity right to be able to fund all these creative projects that we all have as influencers, as um, creators, as streamers. So correct. There's um, yeah. So start to articulate that plan and allow that to download um, and start writing it down because you don't need right now is a perfect time to get into the market. You don't need millions of dollars or hundreds of thousands of dollars to get into this market. Um, you know, you can do it with very minimum and you can do it already with having free money in your account. You know, um, we do have referrals for that as well. We're all winning. Okay, that's what this world is about. Um, creating win, 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 win situations. Yep. And so, yeah, just let us know a little bit of uh, what you're planning or brainstorming or your ideas on how we can all help each other because that's what we're here to do as streamers um, and, yeah, as human beings, really, human divine beings. Yeah, li I like what you said about uh, being able to come together as a community that's what we're all about here at Conscious Crypto every single day at 2 o'clock in the afternoon. And my name is MC Medina. We've got more news. Y'all put a thumbs up in the comments below for Guy Electra giving us the downloads from the ethereals. From the ethereals. Yeah, because this is huge news as far as the NFT market. If you're a creative, please put a thumbs up in the comment. And also... Let us know what are you creating? Maybe we can come together. We can build community and uh, help one another out when it comes to the building of this of this new this new uh, planet. It's like a new reality to me. It's quantum changing. All right, we're this second. Yes, that's a good way to put it. We're gonna get into this visa news. Visa working on blockchain interoperability. Blockchain interoperability hub for crypto payments. Visa's new blockchain interoperability project is designed to serve as a network of blockchain networks. So seems like it's going to have a bunch of networks inside of it. Global payment giant visa has introduced a project that aims to be a universal adapter of blockchains that can connect multiple cryptocurrencies stable coins as well as central bank digital currencies or cbdc according to an official announcement on thursday today visa's research team is working on a universal payment channel or a upc initiative a blockchain interoperability hub connecting multiple blockchain networks 
and enabling transfers of digital assets from different protocols and wallets. Imagine splitting the check with your friends when everyone is at the table is using a different type of money. Some using cash or uh, some using Sweden's Ikrona and others preferring a private stable coin such as US dollar. Um, Visero adding that such tool well may be a reality in the not too distant future with the UPC project developed by Visa's research and product teams, the UPC project is designed to establish dedicated payment channels between different blockchain networks connecting CBDC networks between countries, as well as connecting CBDCs with private stable coin networks. This is huge news, Guy Electra. Visa is going to put together a way where imagine me, you, David, baby shaman and Monica, we're all eating at a restaurant. Mm -hmm. We're all millionaires. Right. Mm -hmm. So we can all pay for our own food. Visa is creating a way for I can pay in crypto. You can pay in U.S. dollars. He can pay in pesos. Wow. She can pay Global. in an altcoin and we can all split the bill right then and there. That's, that's really quantum jumping, guys. <laughs> OK. <laughs> OK, Visa. Come on. We need to make some noise for Visa right now. For all the CEOs, all the COOs that are over there. This, we, this is a very abundant world. Yeah. Uh, I'm the only one who knows how to make noise around here, apparently. Um, next time, hopefully, we can do a better job. However, we'll get a clapper. according to <laughs> an official announcement, um, the Visa research team originally began working on this UPC concept back in 2018. So it's already been almost four years. Does that make sense? Yeah. So it's already been four years in the in the making, developing an interoperability framework that would run independently of the underlying blockchain mechanisms. Ultimately, the uh, UPC solution aims to serve as a network of blockchain networks, adding value to multiple forms of money movement, whether they originate on the Visa network or beyond, is what the announcement reads. One of the world's largest payment companies, Visa made a major move into the crypto industry in 2020, partnering with blockchain firm Circle to support the USD coin, stable coin on certain credit cards. The company has since reaffirmed its commitment to crypto payments and fiat on ramps with a particular focus on stable coin integrations. I mean, this is huge news, guys. What else do we have in the latest? For a second, I thought that TikTok was making its own coin. That would be pretty cool, though, right? That would be interesting, but I'm trying to see if it's somewhere in the news. TikTok, from what I've found here, um, whenever I bring it up, the news. No, I don't think, I don't think, I don't know. Yeah, the news that I'm seeing in regards to TikTok. It's more like they're partnering up. Right. Exactly. So. Sounds good. It looks like Miami is also wanting to incorporate crypto. I think they already doing it. Um, the the government. So. TikTok. Huge news for Switzerland right now. Switzerland's National Postal Service to debut crypto stamp on Polygon. It's huge. The Swiss crypto stamp is a digital collectible linked to traditional mm -hmm. physical stamp issued by the Swiss Post. Nice. Yeah. Let me see. Maybe if I can play this. Let me see if I can play this here. I want to see if people can hear this. Okay, okay, cool, cool, cool. So pretty much 
Uh, the National Postal Service of Switzerland is working on a bridge to gap between the physical stamps and the digital cryptocurrency industry by introducing tradable digital stamps. It's pretty interesting. Nice. It's gonna the, the stamp is gonna provide a digital representation for a physical stamp and will be stored on the blockchain. Each design forms a non fungible token known as an NFT and is stored in the Polygon blockchain. Wow. Buyers are gonna be able to discover a digital twin of their physical stamp online through a QR code printed next to the physical stamp. The crypto stamps image will show one of 13 possible designs that can be collected, um, exchanged, and traded online, is what the Swiss Post said. This is huge news. Pretty big news, yeah. According to a representative for Swiss Post, customers will be able to exchange or sell their crypto stamps on platforms such as major non-fungible token marketplace OpenSea. Swiss Post only sells the Swiss crypto stamp. Trading with it takes place separately from the Swiss Post, says the spokesperson. So once you own it, you own it. Only thing Swiss Post is going to do is sell it that first time. Once you own it, you own it, and you can do whatever you want with it from that point forward. It's crazy, huh? Yes. Man, that's big news. Also, uh, Bitcoin depots crypto atms surpass 5000 as adoption grows bitcoin a atms are becoming increasingly ubiquitous uh, what is it a big ubiquitous ubiquitous y'all let me know how to say this word u b i q u i t o u s the first word i've gotten stuck with since we started uh, especially in north america offering compelling evidence of growing Adoption. I think it's ubiquitous. Ambiguous? Ubiquitous. 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 Anyway, something about the bitches. Uh, Bitcoin Depot's cryptocurrency ATM network continues to expand with North American installations surpassing 5,000 for the first time amid a surge in retail adoption. With the milestone Bitcoin Depot is once again the largest ATM network in North America. The company announced Thursday, that's today, the number of kiosks has tripled in the last six months, giving more users access to cryptocurrency transactions without requiring a bank or other third-party financial service providers. Bitcoin Depot's partnership? Oh my gosh, this is crazy. Okay. Look, guys, I need everybody to go buy Bitcoin right now, okay? This is not financial advice. That's it. Play the music and, for them. Oh, yeah. That's right. That's right. That's right. This is not financial advice. This is a um, financial requirement. <laughs> no, it's a financial It's a financial recommendation, guys. This is huge. Look, Bitcoin Depot's partnership with Circle K convenience stores has been a major source of growth for their crypto kiosk we're seeing in every circle k in north america bitcoin depot is going to have a is a crypto atm and um as Tele coin telegraph reported the two companies announced in july that the convenience store chain will be home of thousands of bitcoin atm machines i mean this is just y'all need to go buy bitcoin if you haven't already put money into a Bitcoin ATM machine, maybe you can consider that. The growth of crypto kiosks is viewed by many as a proxy for the retail adoption of Bitcoin and other digital assets. Crypto ATM installations have surged in El Salvador, where Bitcoin recently became legal tender, giving people an easier way to transact in Bitcoin or convert it into fiat currencies. Salvadorians uh are also making use of their government-backed chivo cryptocurrency wallet according to the president naib bukele more than a third of the country's residents are actively using chivo right now it's an altcoin so this brings me into another related story about el salvador ranking third in the global bitcoin atm installations yay uh, nevertheless, the growth of ATM, Bitcoin ATMs 
isn't without risk. Kraken Security Labs, the security outfit of the popular cryptocurrency exchange, warned earlier this week that a large number of Bitcoin ATMs are susceptible to being hacked because of administrators never change the default admin QR code. The security team said that if hackers are able to obtain the admin code, they can easily, easily walk up to an ATM and compromise it. So uh, if you are a hacker, if you're good with and you're familiar with crypto ATMs, call me. My phone number is 214-815-8555. We'll see what we can get, get going on here and, uh, you know, maybe help save the world, redistribute some funds, decentralize the current financial system. You know what it is. It's about that time. It's 3 o'clock. We're about coming to a close. Guy Electro, what else do you have for us today before we close out? Yes. Um tomorrow oh huge news what's going on tomorrow guys tomorrow is the release <clears throat> of the shivaya remix oh yeah let I'm me super excited you're gonna want to aim your there you go yeah. yeah what is it tomorrow is the release for shivaya for the remix okay um oh. it will be nice oh this is the song right here playing in the background let's go yeah i was gonna ask you is that the remix oh this is the instrumental yeah, this is instrumental. Yep. Hey. So yeah, tomorrow um, it's gonna be available in all platforms. Tomorrow's all streaming platforms. Yes, uh, TikTok. Um, YouTube. YouTube, Spotify. Pandora. Pandora, Shazam. Apple Music. iTunes. Deezer. And more. Title. <laughs> there's so many platforms. There was there's a Latin. Uh, there's one that's in the Latin market. Let me see if I can look it up. Where's my... No, I'm very excited about cryptocurrency and music coming together because that really helps artists. Uh, so please, please support our music. Yeah, it's uh, we make it with a lot of love. So Yeah, it's really important for us to be able to share that with you guys. Um, it's it's something new mantra music it's not something that has become mainstream yet it's 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 still considerably in the underground it's actually pretty mainstream now it's becoming more mainstream every day is what yeah. i'm saying yeah and um and and we want to invite you all to be a part of this new emerging uh more and more mainstream becoming genre called mantra music all right so yeah we got amazon we've got anagami we've got apple music we've got medianet we've got boom play we've got deezer instagram facebook youtube iheart radio claro musica itunes kk box and uh we've got what is it net Ease. I mean, these are platforms I've never heard of. Pandora, Maybe we've heard of. Um, Savin, S A A V N. Obviously, Shazam, TikTok, Spotify. We've got Ten Cent. We've got Tidal, uh, TikTok, and Reso. Twitch, Triller, and finally, Yandex. Oh my God, that's a lot of platforms. Yeah, but so the music is there. Anyways, y'all, listen. Tomorrow, October 1st, huge release day. Make some noise right now for Shiva Ya. Yeah, the remix coming out. And we'll be back. Yeah, we'll be back tomorrow, same time, 2 o'clock Central Standard Time, and then also what's coming up at 5 o'clock. Traffic jams. Traffic jams. Traffic Five o'clock. I'm thinking of seven o'clock with the cacao ceremony as well. Tomorrow? Yeah. Okay, tomorrow, tomorrow we're going to be going live. Party. Look, we're going to be streaming the whole thing live in action. Cameras are going to be set up. We're ordering USB extenders. Y'all, please, please, please make a donation. Consider it. If you're in, a, if you're in, a bun, if you're in an abundant financial position... Please consider making a donation to us. The donation buttons are all down there. Uh, if you haven't downloaded Cash App, I got to send you a link. 
free money in your pocket. You can buy Bitcoin through Cash App. Yes. Thank y'all for hanging out with us. We're closing it out. Again, my name is MC Medina. I'm Gaia Electra. And this is Conscious, Conscious Crypto. Crypto. Every day at 2 o'clock, 2 to 3. Let's go. Find us on social media, guys. Share with your friends and your family. <laughs>